Hi guys, it's Sid, and welcome back to my channel. I'm honestly not very excited for this video. Yes, you read the title correctly. I'm gonna be waking up at 5 a.m. every day for a week. You guys, I kind of have like a little bit of a problem. I've been sleeping in so late. I feel like I lost self-discipline or something. I guess the better way to phrase it would be that I have no structure when it comes to sleep. Why am I sleeping till 10 every morning? Who let that happen? Well, I did. I just wanna have a schedule, you know? I wanna be on top of my this year, even though this year is almost over. And you may ask, why am I choosing the other extreme? Why am I going to wake up at 5 a.m.? I believe if I force myself to wake up at 5 a.m. for a week, that's really gonna show me the rock bottom, the earliest possible time. So I can only go uphill. Then I'll probably start waking up at normal times, like 7.30. But I feel like I need a little reality check, you know? It is currently Sunday night. It's 9.55 p.m. The thing is that I kind of have to take this in phases because I'm so used to going to bed so late that even if I did get in bed by 8 p.m. right now, I'd be wide awake. I'd just be staring at my ceiling for two hours. It's the way you act. It's stuck in my head, I can't stop thinking about it. You know that guy that I'm talking about from TikTok? It's the way you act, it's the way you act. <laughs> All right, let's go to bed. Nowhere else, we're just going to bed. Hello? It's the way you act. It's the way you act. What? What are you trying to say to me? Do you not know what I'm talking about? No. F I can't believe I'm waking up at 5 a.m. for no reason. Not no reason, but like, you know, if I had a flight or if I had a meeting or, or like something at 5 a.m., but like, it's the way I'm just doing this to myself. Good night. I'll see you at 5 a.m. So triggering. Good morning, you guys. I feel like I just went to bed. So here's the thing. Oh my god. Oh, it's cold in here. Okay, guys. So good morning. It does feel like I actually just went to bed. I need coffee. I need to find a place that's open. Ugh, they're all closed. It's too early. I kind of want to go to Duncan. Oh wait, Duncan opens at 6.30. I think I'm gonna have to go there because I, like, I need it. I have to make my bed or else I'm just gonna crawl right back in there. Okay, it's a legging hoodie vibe today with hoop earrings though. I love wearing jewelry with casual outfits like this because it just dresses up any outfit. Okay, I know this is gonna seem like the same clip to you, but I had to wait a good 45 minutes just to leave my house because Duncan wasn't open yet. <laughs> I think it's like sunrise right now. Oh yeah, it is, the sun is rising. I literally haven't been up this early since I've moved here. There's a lot less people out. That's for sure. Look how dead it is. Oh my God, there's a girl running. I'm so proud of her. Imagine having your life together that much. Like running at sunrise. Oh my God, I'm here. <gasps> Thank God. I'll do the iced caramel latte, please. I got a donut and hash browns. Oh, what's this? I ordered this donut and then they gave me two donut holes and a regular donut. Maybe they were just feeling generous today. I literally never get donuts. I also don't know why I got this. And then I got my coffee. I got an iced caramel latte. And then I got hash browns. Like, I have so much stuff in front of me. I, I didn't mean to get this much. Well, well, well. Here we are again. Oops. <laughs> So I just took a screenshot. I slept so bad last night, you guys. I kept waking up. I think it's because I kept anticipating that my alarm was gonna go off. Like I'd wake up and just look at the clock and see how many more hours I had left. It's day two and we are not quitters around here. Things get hard, but we keep pushing through. I have a piano lesson this morning. It's kind of far. It's in really Northern Manhattan. So I'm gonna have to subway. It's also my first piano lesson and I'm really excited. 
first things first, you know we have to make the bed. Or else I will get back in it. I have my piano lesson at 9 a.m. I haven't had piano lessons in probably like eight years. So it's been a really long time and I just wanted to get like back into it because I miss it a lot. When I play piano now, I just do synesthesia, which basically is just like visually seeing the notes. I don't actually read sheet music. So I'm worried, guys, it's gonna be tough for me. Wait, I forgot to tell you guys something. I have to tell you. Last week I ordered dinner for myself. I ordered this burger and fries, which is honestly interesting because I really don't eat meat very much. So I postmated it here. I had it for dinner around like 8 p.m. And I went to bed and I was like, oof, my stomach hurts, but I'm just gonna try to sleep. So I went to bed. And then I was force awakened. Something came over me and I just sat up in bed abruptly and I was like, I'm gonna get sick right now. Long story short, I got food poisoning for the first time and food poisoning has been a huge fear for me. I don't know what it is. I've always been so deathly afraid of food poisoning. Honestly, maybe it's a good thing that I got it out of the way because now I know what it's like, but it's, it's horrible. It's literally exactly what I thought it would be. Never again will I be ordering from that restaurant. I'm honestly scarred from just like burgers in general. I don't know why I even did that. So anyways, okay, I'm gonna get dressed. Hey guys, so I just got out of my piano lesson. Since it was the first one, I felt really awkward asking to film, so I didn't, like I didn't really film it, I'm so sorry. It went well, but like I forgot way more than I thought I did. But I got the homework, like I feel like I'm in school again. It was actually really fun though. My instructor is so nice and he's so funny. Anyways, I'm in a subway home and I'm actually like not even that tired, honestly. So I'm getting ready for bed now. Just take a guess, guess what time it is. 7.30, 7.30 and I'm getting ready for bed. I think I just need to catch up on sleep, but I also think that means like my body's adjusting hopefully. I'm gonna go to bed. Love you guys and I'll see you in the morning. Good morning. Here's the thing. I have to use up one of my workout classes that I already bought before it expires. And there's a class that starts in an hour, so you know what that means, Pilates. Okay guys, I feel so good. I love reformer Pilates. It's so much fun because it's different than like a standard workout. I'm also not that tired. Like I thought, especially after I worked out, it starts to hit me, but I'm actually like kind of fine. I think I'm gonna go get coffee though. I'm gonna stay ahead of my energy. Just because I'm not tired now doesn't mean it won't hit me. So I made a mistake. Don't hate me. Hi guys, good morning. I'm really sorry, you guys. I don't know how to break it to you, but it's not 5 a.m. <laughs> it's actually 10 a.m. I just woke up because I hit snooze. It's always the snooze that does it for me. Um, I'm guilty. I did hit snooze this morning. I actually, I thought I hit snooze, but I must have turned it off completely because then I never heard it go off again. And now here I am feeling like a failure. I didn't even want to film this. Like, I'm embarrassed. Why, why did I do this to myself? I'm gonna still try to carry on with my day, even though I'm kind of like upset about this. Like this is really putting me off on the wrong foot. So. You know, I know today was a fail, but I promise I'll be better tomorrow, you guys. I really will. I never thought I'd see the day, but it's the last day I have to do this. Who is? <laughs> I'm so happy that I'm done with this guys. I want to have kind of like a slow 
chill, relaxing morning. Usually I don't have time for that, but since I have nothing else to do, I wanna do a little face mask and maybe read a little bit. I also try to make it really cozy in here. Look at this bag that I just got, guys. I think this is the most adorable bag. It says secrets on it. I was gonna get this one that looks like this that said makeup, but then I felt like it wasn't as mysterious, you know? Like, what's in here? I mean, we all know it's just skincare, but... My hoodie matches my face mask. It's weird waking up so early that it's still dark out. Like my brain feels like it's nighttime or something. But this is the book I'm reading. I got this a couple vlogs ago. The sad part is I'm only halfway done. I should have finished it like two weeks ago. DND mode. Do not disturb. My skin feels so good. I just wanted to end the vlog. Thank you guys for watching. You know, will I be doing this again? Absolutely not. But I do think I'm gonna try to wake up consistently at like 7.30 or 8 a.m. and just like kind of get into a routine. I'm lucky I don't have to wake up at 5 a.m. every day as it is. Anyways, I love you guys and I'll see you in my next vlog. Bye guys. Bye.